Okay, here we are. Here at the fabulous PSD High Park. The sun is out again. Oh. I'm here with Jess, <laughs> Zara, and AJ, the Wandering Hearts. Hi. Hello. You know, it's been fabulous for you really today, because um, last year you played at the Barclay Dance stage. Yes. This year, the honour the honor of this fabulous stage, which is quite good. We're just starting right now. Yeah. And, uh, you're it's smaller like, than it was earlier. This is not quite a life-size model. You know. not, a little bit less warm. Yeah. <laughs> but but you know, how was it for you today? You, know, you open the show, so what goes through your mind when you see a sea of a thousand people, thousands of thousands of people? Uh, it's a weird one really I guess, like it doesn't really, you come on with this kind of mentality of like, have, you know, you've got to go on, you've got to do your thing. Yeah. You get out there and it does kind of, I guess, it kind of throws you a little bit because there's so many people, but at the same time, like when you see people engage, yeah, instantly, yeah. like, you're instantly kind of, you're just enjoying it and getting yeah. into it. I think really... you have to enjoy it as well, like after doing Very the cool. Barclay yeah. Card for the last two, like the last two years, we could always see the main stage of the Barclay Card. So to be like, and you never thought, I never thought we'd play it. No. Like, I don't know why, not for like a little bit. So to play it, you're like, oh my God, we're the bit that I always thought that I could yeah. see from really far away. Yeah. So you just try and enjoy it. What's well, that sort of one of your dreams? So you played a party club last two years, right? Yeah. 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 I just didn't think it'd be this year. No, so yeah. no really idea. Very I lucky. didn't see any of the trees either. I couldn't see any of that from the stage. How about you guys? But look how much tree is going. There is a lot of trees. Tree. Tree. Did you see any of that? No, I, I, I looked up. I didn't. It is. It's a fabulous leafy We were there. That yeah, that's how small we are. It's, it's a scale. I mean, that's, that is teeny. This is garden force. We are now at the bottom. Welcome. Well, since well, last year, there were four of you, and since then, one of the hearts has gone wandering. They yeah. have. Yeah. Yeah. But we were so lucky this year, so we've got the most amazing band. Um, we've got Sean playing drums. Um, she's the most amazing female drummer. Yeah. And we've got uh, Julian playing, ba uh, playing guitar and then Lee playing bass. So to be up there, I don't think we've ever had such a big band on stage. So yes, so we're one less member, but got a team of six on stage. So it's the best it's we ever feel, felt. I yeah. It feels like it feels stronger than ever. Yeah. Yeah. Right. How does that compare with it? You know, these now three pieces. Does it make it like a little bit harder? Not so much. I, don't, I wouldn't say harder at all. Um, I think it's. Um, we, we're all about, you know, when we, we've been writing our second album and it's, it's all about, for us, like, you know, the lyrics and obviously, like, the harmonies and stuff and, you know, we've got three voices so we can still do quite a lot with that. Yeah. And, um, all your chords are kind of, like, covered. We haven't got to worry about anything at any point. Like, and we're all very kind of intuitive with yeah. one another. Like, so the moment we kind of start playing something, you can sing a note and instantly the other two people at the back Found go, their way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If, any, if anything, I think you're right, because it kind of becomes easier. So I think if you've got four, you're trying to cover Musically speaking, you normally have like you know, the melody, the third, the fifth, and maybe someone doubling the octave. But not having that, it really allows you to zone in and um, I don't know, it feels it feels special. It feels more special to, to, to us than it ever has done before. And the kind of traction that we've had this year um, and the way things are going, all we can do is just keep looking forward and feel really lucky. We just did this. Yes, exactly. Um, yeah, yeah. That we do this. It feels yeah. really cool. Yeah, yeah. So we're, we're pretty, and Celine's playing later. So we're, we're yeah. pretty excited. Yeah, yeah. Well, we, that's a great thing about your band too. You, you, you could go on quite a diverse bill. You know, yeah. Like, 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 yeah. 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 We do kind of fit into lots of different boxes. I think we've just been talking about that and how we never kind of tried to define what genre we are in as a band. Um, we kind of sing and write and the sound that we make is the sound that we make and everyone it's kind of everyone else's job to, to decide. It's their job to decide. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you know, and so we kind of get taken into all these different kind of camps of Americana and country and folk and you know, we play all these amazing festivals and, and it's just it's so great to, to feel like we, we've been accepted in all those, those well, different places. Talk about festivals, you've just been out to Nashville, the CMA Fest. Yes. Yes. Oh, oh, oh we had a great time, didn't we? Yeah, CMA great. Fest is so busy, isn't it? It's yeah. Like how many people to set? Oh like hundreds of thousands of people turn up just to Nashville for that. Yeah. It's like chaos from it's like one week to the next. It's yeah. Yeah. unrecognizable. It's totally right? mad, but it is there's a it's lovely so vibe. Fun. It's like if you haven't been around like year two when the yeah. season mm. like you know there's this lovely vibe and it's really yeah. like energetic and kind of like prickly and kind of yeah. like in a good way. Yeah, yeah. Like static almost. You can yeah, there's an energy. Yeah, yeah. And, and and over in CMA Fest like Nashville, like imagine that, but the entire breadth of a whole 
the city, yeah. which is a lovely kind of like villagey, like vibey, energetic city anyway. Yeah. Everywhere you go, you've just got this like lovely bounce. Yeah. Wanting to listen to great ones. And other Americans take you to Wandering Hearts. Oh yeah. We've been yeah. so lucky with we that. Went we back and we got played the opera the opera third yeah. time. Yeah. And yeah. I mean, we were invited to do that. They but, said, uh, let's turn up again. Yeah. So, and they, yeah. when we did it, they were like, oh, you guys can come back here whenever you want. But I always think back to the first time. So our first international gig was less than 24 hours after we landed in Nashville and we were playing the Ryman Auditorium yeah. which is the most wonderful, hallowed, beautiful space and it was us, Chris Stapleton, uh, John Prime, Margot Prime, Margo it was just this amazing lineup and we sang two songs and at the end of the second song there was this mad standing ovation at the Ryman Auditorium yeah. and we had never been to America, nobody knew yeah. who we were um, and all we have had since then is just the most wonderful enthusiasm and response and nobody's going you are this or you aren't that, yeah. you are country, you're not country, you're this or that. Everybody's just so, and you can say I think pretty generally everybody, yeah. and it's quite hard to say that normally. Yeah. Um, so we, we love the UK, we love our fans here, but we have been so lucky in the States. Mm. It's Excellent. really That's special. That's mostly just an Yeah, it is an yeah, we are, we are an artist. Yeah. Yeah. Put us on the yeah. line. Show we get to the yeah, it's well. true. Like, I believe you went to Canada as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Was, it, it was, yeah. We did a little bit of recording out there. Yeah. Um, and some sightseeing. And some sightseeing. Yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah. Good it's good to do some sightseeing you don't always yeah. get that chance. We had one, we'd one day off in like four weeks and we went up to CN Tower. Yeah. And um, AJ was fine, me and Jess were going. <laughs> I was like, oh, it was no, quite quiet. Quiet. Yeah. 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 AJ's going, I was like, Jess, spinning around. Yeah. Canada's amazing. Yeah. It's got a great, some great place. laws there now as well, uh -huh. which is wonderful. Yes. So, well, yeah. Well, it's a great place. <laughs> <laughs> can you guess? You can have as much gin as you want. It's a great place. It's a really lovely place. You've uh, recently shot, shot a video for Loving Breaks Like a Heart. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Have you been heartbroken before? Oh, oh yeah. Of course. Of course. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Most makes the best right. musician. Yeah. 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 So much of the music that we write like comes from stuff that we talk about yeah. and experiences yeah. we've had in our life, like it should do, you know. Um, and the heartbreak is a big part of that. We're pretty open with each other when we talk. Mm -hmm. okay. Especially for a song we didn't write, yeah. to kind yeah, of like be that. able to lose yourself a, in utter heartbreak. Yeah. It was a really special moment actually for us right. in the studio because okay. it's the first time we've been back in the studio since really since we recording the first album, yeah. we were back in the same studio as that we recorded as the three as well. Yeah. And we had this amazing, it was like the coolest day. The coolest day. Oh, and so we had our team around us, we had Lee, our bass player, and we had Steve, our manager, and we had Neil, who's the sound engineer. And he was there when we recorded our first Yeah, album. and so it was this team of people that really know us really well. They were all team, didn't they? Everyone yeah. was like hanging out. And we reworked and this song, and we were like, this is actually really cool. Like. And it, we kind of all connected on, on different levels, but um, it just became something that felt just, I think it was more about like the day and like the, that whole process of the day and going through that process of recording a cover as well, something that wasn't ours. And it became this thing that we were so proud of. And we were like, oh my God, this is amazing. Like, and also has kind of been a bit of a channel for like, maybe where we're going to go with the next album and where, and where we can go with it, what we're capable of. And, and so it was, it was a really, really great memory for us that day. And um, yeah, it's a... Uh, it felt very free. It, 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 felt, it felt, felt very free. It was, it was a, a really good day. Yeah. 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 I know you're a big fan of Fleetwood Mac. Obviously, you've been out in the States, Nashville, and everything. So, did you get to see Fleetwood Mac on his cover tour? No. 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 My, 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 my fiance did. Yeah. It was so sad. Like, she was there, she filmed it. Although, she did uh, She did try and make me watch it on YouTube yesterday. Yeah. Oh. Like, it's the same. No. <laughs> the nearest we've got to it is when we when we when we opened the Barclay Crown stage two years ago. Stevie Nicks did yeah, one yeah, of yeah. the yeah. 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 So that's yeah. sadly that's the closest yeah, we got. Yeah. So I think we've always had gigs. Yeah, we had yeah. gigs. Did you get a chance to meet Stevie that day or not? No, uh, she no, she waved. Oh, which was nice. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Next time we'll call. But also, I don't think we always want to. I don't know whether you always want to meet. 
you know, you're right. It's like everyone's like, oh, Celine Dion. And I was like, oh, I just, I love her so much. There's situations like that where you've met one of your heroes and you thought, oh, my God. Yeah. It's never quite the same, is it? Well, it's, well, it's, well, do you know what? It's so hard, isn't it? Because, like, when you're doing shows and you're in the middle of, you know, about to go on stage or just come off stage, we know it. You know, there's so much going on. If it's a good show, if it's a bad show, if something happened, you you know, you kind of, and then if you meet fans, you kind of, you have to be on it and you have to kind of, you know, be like, oh yeah, thank you so much. But sometimes you can get caught out. Sometimes it can be a bit like, oh, like in a moment and doing your own thing. And that, and then if you meet your fan, if you meet your idols and that's happening, you're kind of well, like, oh, well, no, the great things about them I really parts. like so, you. You're, you're always happy and chirpy. So, <laughs> yeah. I'm sure they won't get experience. Yeah, we, we are actually yeah. mostly we are pretty, pretty chill. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be very rare to catch one of us when we come off stage and storming off. Well, that's <laughs> what, that's what's be. so nice about the way we are as a band. Is it's just like the energy is so nice and chill and relaxed in a way that has never been before and yeah. it feels really special that and like our wider team are like that and so yeah we're zen it's yeah. cool yeah it's good good so what's next for the wandering hearts well we're doing uh well we're, we're supporting some uh we're supporting yeah, jacks already yeah. on some of this oh, yeah. 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 yeah so we're playing the county chase the same mm-hmm. playing these beautiful forests yeah, yeah. It's and amazing. Uh, then we're going to be doing uh we've got a couple of shows at north as well uh, yeah. near Newcastle away, summertime and that. A few time. festivals. Yeah, yeah, festivals. Yeah. And then we're going to be going out to the States again. Oh, pretty soon. Finish off yeah. recording the second album. Do some touring uh, out there. We've got some shows. We're supporting Larkin Power in LA in yeah. November. Yeah. And we've got a festival in Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah. Yeah. And we're yeah. going to be releasing yeah. some more music. Good. I look forward to that. Oh, yeah. 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 Cool. I'm Robin Hartshaw. Lovely band. Thank you. Lovely people. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. All the best for the future. Thank you. Cheers. All the best. Thank you.